Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. So, in the last episode, we got to the sanctuary with Zelda after we got killed by like a shit ton of rats. And uh, I'm just gonna open this treasure chest. Oh, damn. It's oh, not even for defeating a boss. That's awesome. Okay, so now we're gonna talk to this guy with the glasses here. First, you should go meet the village elder and get the master sword. What? What? Oh, what? What? What the heck is going on? No one even's telling me what is happening. Just some evil wizard just came and just started killing everyone. And whoa, whoa! Now we're outside. What is this? Still these guys though. Still gotta kill these green. No, what? no! We still suck at Zelda. <laughs> I learned nothing from my last encounter. Okay, so I gotta go see the gotta go see the elder to get the master sword wherever he's gonna be at. And I guess I'll just check this way. Okay, so oh, here's a sign. Let's see what does it say? This way, Kakar Kakariko Village. Alright, so let's go to Kakariko Village, I guess. Maybe there's, there's gonna be something over there that we can do. What does this sign say? This way, Kakariko Village. Alright. Alright, so now we're in Kakariko. Awesome! Alright. Hey, this guy looks like where we were in the beginning. Warned. Kidnap Princess Zelda. Call a soldier if you see him. Hey, it looks like Pinocchio. Just kidding, it looks like me. So, I've been, I guess I have an, a, a bounty on my head or something. Let's go, oh, what's going on with my uh, video here? Anyways, talk to this guy. Who? Oh, it's you, Suki. What can an old woman like me do for a youngster like you? Who, the elder? Oh, no one has seen him since the wizard's been abducting his victims. What, Master Sword? Well, I don't remember the details exactly, but... Long ago, a prosperous people known as the Hy Hylians inhabited this land. Legend tells of treasures with mystical powers that remain from the Highland Age, the Master Sword, a mighty blade forged to thwart those with evil hearts as one, and is said to now rest deep in the forest. Did you understand the legend? At this rate, seek the Elder. There must be someone in the village who knows where he is, Suki. Take care. Alright, so we gotta go find the village Elder, because apparently he been hiding. So, uh, this chick's got a big house, man. And two doors. What, what is it? What is the? What is the two doors? So, yeah, now that I fixed that, we can go ahead and go on. But we're gonna have to maneuver around these, uh, these little things in order to get this treasure. But we have a whole bunch of treasure from those rats. But, uh, let's see if we can't maneuver around these, uh, treasure chests. So, uh, alright, let me push this one, and this one, and this one, and this will be the first one. Alright. Awesome. Okay, so let's move on. Uh, we can get this one pretty easily because there's just one block away. Um, let me, let's, uh, let's reset the puzzle so we can get those last two. Looks like they're going to be kind of complicated. So we'll go upstairs and go downstairs. And, uh, alright. Okay, so let me see here. Um, I'll just... Push this here, and this here, this one down, and this one down, and we'll push this one over, and alright, starting to get a lot of rupees, and I'll just push this one, and this one, and awesome, I'm really good at puzzles apparently, that's a relief because I really suck at Zelda, but at least I'm good at puzzles, so there's that to look forward to. Alright, so now we gotta look for the Elder, he's got the sword, we need the sword, so let's go see if we can find him. We'll check Kakariko Village, and uh, see if we can't come across some, uh... Hey, what's up that guy? Why'd he just run away? Where'd he go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? We lost him. Fuck. Alright, whatever, he's probably not important anyway. So yeah, we gotta go find the Elder, and... Hey, there's that guy again! What the? Come back here! Yeah! I got an idea, check this out, check this out. Okay, I'm gonna come over here, reset him, and then come back, and boomerang! Uh, yeah, come back, you bitch! Alright, one more time, one more time, one more time, and then I'm done. And... Come back, come back! Ugh, whatever. Oh, Suki, someone's been spreading rumors saying you kidnapped the princess, but I still trust you. Well, you should, because that is horse shit. Oh, dang, it's Cluckos. I feel inclined to, uh, to attack them, so I'm gonna, gonna attack you a few times. But I'm afraid of Clickos, because I know they can kill me, so I'm just gonna hit him one more time and go. And, uh, there's that asshole again. Whatever, fuck you guy. Um, where the hell is this elder at? What's in here? 
All right, so there's some dude sleeping. Sniff, hey brother Suki, do you have a bottle to keep a bug in? Oh, maybe not. Cough, cough. Oh, get it, get it. He has a he has a bug, and he needs he needs you to get rid of his bug. So if we had a, if we had a, that's funny. You're a funny sleeping man. Elder, oh shit. Select the R button. Blah blah. blah. Um, I wonder if we buy some potion if we get a free bottle. Is that how that works? Oh, I guess not. Well, I guess we'll just get some bombs, because we got, like, a fuck ton of money from rats and picking up shit. So, yeah, now we have bombs. I guess we don't need a bomb bag, so let's just go ahead and see if we can find them. Hey, Suki, who, the old guy? You mean the elder? Okay, but don't tell any bad guys about this. He's hiding in the palace past the castle. I'll mark the spot on your map. Well, that's fantastic. Now... Now we know where he's at. I'm just gonna check the map, and he's... Holy crap, he's way the fuck over there. That's far. How the hell are we gonna get all the way over there? God damn it. Ah, son of a bitch. I maintain that this game needs to be like Skyrim, so I can just fast travel, because that is way too far. I don't even know how to get over there. Alright, let's see. Looks like it's this way. Alright, yeah, this, this, is, uh, this is field music, so maybe this is the right place. Let's go in here and see what's in here. Oh, neat. Secret, secret tunnel. Let's see, is there anything here? Just, can I go through here? Maybe put a bomb here? Let's get our bombs and see if we can blow this blow this up. And... Nope, it's not going. Oh, well, fuck it. Let's get out of here. This place is lame. Alright, so uh, let's get out of here. Hit some of this shit. Kill this green dude. Fuck you, green dude. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Okay, can't go that way. Can't go this way. Damn it, how do we get to this place? Where are you, mystery place? What's in here? There's a house? It's a blacksmith. If my lost partner returns, we can tamper your sword, but right now I can't do anything for you. Well, that's fantastic. We Apparently we can get our swords upgraded. I haven't played this game in forever. I don't even remember what you can do, like what you can and can't do. I don't remember there being a blacksmith. That's just, that's, that's like Skyrim. I wanna do some Skyrim shit. It'd be cool. So yeah, we'll just go up because it looks like uh, that's that's where our best bet for getting to that palace is. And uh, we'll just go this way. Where the fuck is this palace? Where the fuck is palace? Where the fuck are you at, bro? Come on. Man, fast travel or run faster. Like in like in Majora's Mask when you can get the bunny ears. That would be so cool if we could get bunny ears. Because then I could just run through all this shit and not have to like deal with any of the bullcrap. Kill this blue guy, because fuck you blue guys. You blue guys suck ass and I hate you all. Um, I like how my sounds all synced up. Oh wow, look at this arrow. It's like, go that way, bro. Why didn't I see this arrow before? Oh, maybe he's supposed to... Because there's like a little indentation there. Maybe you're supposed to like jump through it. Okay, no, that definitely kills us. Alright, definitely not. But there's a bridge here, which is probably where... Oh crap, I put bombs. I'll just push you towards him. Haha! -ha! Master plan in action. That's what I like to see. Alright, so let's go this way. Maybe I can just run past these guards and I feel like fighting because I'm losing all my life and that's bullshit. And we're not even close. Alright, so I'll go back this way. <clears throat> Cut this same grass. Man, there's so much backtracking. There's probably gonna be like some sort of fast travel type deal in this game later on, because it's just just way too much backtracking. And uh oh sweet, there's like Mega Man little robot enemies. Uh, like maybe that's what they need their perpetual energy for, these Mega Man robots that they have periodically just placed all over the place shooting rocks at me like a dick. Perpetual rocks for everyone. That's, uh, I think we're getting there. I think we're getting there. This looks like this is where we gotta be. Let's kill that fucking... Yeah, fuck it. Moving on, moving on. Let's see. Yeah, we're, like, almost there. So he's definitely around here somewhere. Fuck you, Mega Man. Robots. Fuck you guys. You guys suck. Jump down here. And go in here. Oh, damn. This looks like an elder. I am indeed... Whatever. The village elder and a descendant of the seven sages. Oh, really? I'm surprised that one so young is searching for the sword of evil's bane. Suki, not just anyone can use that blade. Legends say only the hero who has won the three pendants can wield the sword. Do you truly wish to find it? Uh, yeah. 
Good. For the first test, can you retrieve the Pennant of Courage from the East Palace? If you bring it here, I shall share more of my knowledge with you. Can I? Can I do that? You bet, bro. Oh, snap. Secrets. Can I still not do anything about these pots? Can I blow them up? No? There's a secret dun tunnel back there. Let me see. Just blow it up. Maybe it'll give me, like, a way in. It Damn it! Get out of my fucking way, you stupid pots! How do I get rid of you? <sighs> I like how my sound's, like, totally not synced up right now. I can I can hear all the animations happening like a little sec a couple of seconds after I actually do them. That's interesting. Yeah, I've, I've played Ocarina of Time. I know all about you, statue dickheads. I don't care about you. So let's see. Maybe we gotta go this way. Just run around enemies. Uh, dead end. I guess we have to fight some of you. Oh, you're much easier than in Zelda. I mean, Ocarina of Time. Kill some, uh, kill some statues. Kill some statues and proceed onward, because that's just how we roll. Alright, let's go this way. Fuck you, don't care, jump down here. Okay, the map says we're running away, and that leads away from it, and that also leads away from it. Yeah, let me die. Come on, come on, come on, die. Die, 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 die. I'm checking too long to kill. Thanks for that heart, bro. Lord knows we needed a heart piece. We was dying. So let's go... I think this is over here is where we have to get to that palace. Kill this guy, get a rupee. Not give any shits about these... Ah, fuck you, blue guy. Fuck you. I hate how that sword is like their secret shield. Run! No statue fights for me. Oh, damn. We're in the East Palace. All right. Let's see, maybe we're supposed to um, something with those statues, definitely. Uh, there's no bridge here. Let's go this way instead. Uh, maybe I'm supposed to. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But there's an entrance here, and there's still no and there's still no bridge. All right, so it's definitely something with the eyes or something with the pots it's got to be one of the two some poke big pokey poke no it's not doing it it's not doing it maybe i throw the boomerang at him maybe blind him in his face let's push the pot let's push the pot nope that doesn't do anything i'm supposed to push this okay what the hell what am i supposed to do what do you want me to do what do you want from me east palace I need answers. Give me like a sign. Throw a boomerang. Nothing is working. Nothing is doing anything at all. So instead, I'll just fall? Nope, that kills us. And now we're like to one life. And if I take one more health, I'm gonna die. So I'll just pick up this pot with my brain powers and maybe push this one. What is with these goddamn pots? These pots suck, man. Oh my god, you could pick them up? What the fuck? Are you serious? This whole time I've been just like dicking around with these stupid pots and you can pick them up? Just. I thought you had to get like some special bracelet or something. Well, that answers that question. So I'm gonna kill these enemies. I feel like an idiot. Whoa, these dudes have lots of rupees. There's just so much rupees in this game. You get you get a colossal amount of rupees. Like, if I was in this world, I would never feel out of rupees because they're literally everywhere. Okay, I'm assuming we gotta not get hit by these balls and die. So I died. That is fantastic. That is just fan fucking tastic. Well, we know we know they get down. We know what's up. We gotta pick up the pot, push the button. Apparently we can't leave with pots. We gotta press this button. And we'll just fucking ignore this and those dudes. Go this way. Jump down here. Do not get hit by these balls. They're balls of death. Ow, fuck. Ow, fuck. Okay, so we gotta hide behind these pillars, obviously. Because uh, they hurt. These balls hurt. They must be like giant marbles. Like, this is, this is like giant marble version of that, that classic scene from, like, that Indiana Jones movie that everyone always talks about. Because they're all hipsters. 
and I haven't seen it because I apparently I'm not cool enough. So I'll just go up here and uh, oh snap, secret treasure! It's the 100 rupees. We found it. We finally found it. I would jump down there and go through that shit again, but nah, fuck that. I'll just go this way instead. So, oh, here's the door. It's right here. How could I be so silly and not see it? I'm so silly. Let's go this way. Seeds, more pots. Uh, I get. To, oh, I'm gonna have health in it. Okay, that opens that door. Fuck that door. I'm gonna see what's over here first. I'm gonna go over here because I don't give any shits. That one closes it. We don't want it to close. We want it open. So I'm gonna go in here. Skeleton people! Oh, they're assholes and they like to jump. But apparently they can be stunned. I'm just gonna keep stunning them and hit them. Oh, they just die from boomerang? Can you imagine if that's if that was a thing? Like, you could just boomerang someone in the face to death? Maybe you can. Maybe I should... Yeah, like in Final Fantasy thirteen, that little kid just beats people up with that big-ass boomerang. Like, if I got hit in a big-ass big boomerang like that, then yeah, I'd probably die, but... Not from, like, a little one. Okay, we're in a classic Zelda room where I clearly gotta either A, pick up something and press a button, or those enemies will come to life. You fool no one, enemies on ground. I know you're about to come up and become real. Oh, plot twist. They actually don't. They just fucking appear. Well, that's fantastic. So now I know we gotta kill these dudes, so... Man, this boomerang shit is really hard to do. I wonder if I walked into a room and just saw a bunch of walking around skeletons if I'd be afraid. I don't know. I mean, like, it's just a skeleton. It's like, it's like skin and bones. It's like, you know, your fear is based off of how big or small something is. So if it's like a skeleton, it's like, what can it really do? It doesn't have any muscle. It can't really hurt you. It could just be really gross and touch you. I guess I'd be afraid of it being touched. Hey, what? I found compass? We found a compass before a dungeon map. What kind of dungeon is this? This is the most arbitrary dungeon ever. What the hell is this thing? Suki, this is Shakalaka. I can teach you. I can talk to you telepathically when you touch these tiles. I have advice for you. The treasure hidden in the palace will help you defeat armored foes. Do we really face armored foes? I don't think I've ever faced any. Can't push that block. Let's try this one. I can push that block, but I can't push it any further. So, fuck that area, we'll come back later when we'll, we'll, get, we'll probably need something that will come and get them. Oh, maybe that's the armored foe. Come at me, bro. Ah, run away. Whoa, that's a big-ass chest. What's in it? You need the big key to open this chest? What kind of shit is that? Since when have you ever needed a big key to open a chest? This is the weirdest Zelda ever. This door... Also needs the big, big key. Alright, this is definitely the boss room. So, obviously, you're not supposed to be here right now. We'll come back later when we have uh, big boss key stuff. Big boss key. No, another dark room. No, I'm fucking gonna get murdered by whatever these weird red things are. Just gonna run this way. Looking for somewhere, anywhere. I found it. We'll go in here. And, uh, another room with bullshit. Another room with bull- and skeletons? Come on, man. Come on. I don't want to fight these things in the dark. They're hard as shit to hit. And in the dark, I can't even see where they're coming from. God damn it, fucking skeleton douchebags. Damn it, I died. Son of a bitch. Okay, so we made it back, and uh, I reasoned that I can just swing my sword and these dudes will leave me alone. But uh, it looks like we're going to have to kill them, because they, they, they have to go. This room has nothing in it except a bunch of enemies, and if you play any Zelda, you know that that means that you're supposed to kill them all, and they all have to go. So we're just going to go ahead and kill all these dudes, and uh, hopefully they don't kill me. Um... Maybe I should skip this, it's not going to be that, that entertaining, other than you can watch me fail at Zelda. But let's be honest, that's probably why you're watching the beginning. Because I fail at Zelda, I do. I fail. Alright, so, uh, there's that guy. So we just got this, uh, can't really, it kind of sucks in the dark. And we're going to die again. Okay, cool. So... 
there's nobody in here, which means one of these has a key under it, and that's weird that it's actually the first one I picked up. That's a little weird. It just happened. I didn't know it was there. I just picked it up, and that's what happened. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pick up all these pots because they have some pretty cool stuff under them. Um, I do need magic. I do want health, and it's just always a good idea to have health and magic. So now we'll go this way, and uh, we'll avoid these balls, and use our key here. We'll come in here, and it'll lead us back to the room with the balls. Okay. So, looks like we're, we're uh, going to make it out alive. We're going to be doing alright then. Alright, so there's some weird glowy thing in the middle of the room, and I have no idea. There's lots and lots and lots and lots of enemies here. So I'm just going to kill as many as I can without killing all of them, because I don't think I can kill them all. Uh, let's see if I can kill these things. Nope, but it looks like they're guarding something. It's, it's like there's something there that they don't want us to have. Okay, so maybe I'll just kill everyone in here, because it looks like I can. Okay, let's just go ahead and kill you, big eye. Don't open your eye, man. Open it. Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Ah! I was ready. Okay, come on. Wake up. Wake up, guy. Die already. Okay, so that just leaves a skull bastard. This thing's moved too much. Oh, come on. I thought I had him in that little corner, but I guess not. No, he's protected. Die. Come on. These skull enemies are about to become my least favorite. Oh, Jesus. Oh, jeez. Sweet. Oh dang, we found the big boss key. Now we can go back. But uh, we're actually going to do that in the next episode. So uh, in, the, in the next episode, we're going to get to that room with the big ass key. And we're going to try and see what's going on in there. Uh, thanks for watching. And tune in next time. See ya.